Jimmy Mook! Welcome back to another quick ripping with Mark Rippin. And we've got uh, today, we've got uh, 91 upper deck Mark Rippin. Um, he's uh, throwing up the, I don't know if he's calling for a ball there or calling for, uh, or throwing the peace sign. I'm not really sure what he's doing there, but we got 91 Mark Rippin. He's ready to go. He's rocking and rolling because we've got this. We've got, uh, we're doing a little more. Uh, 2023 a 24 Bowman Chrome U basketball. So uh, we just had the national championship for the women and the men are actually, when I'm recording this, are, are actually uh, playing tonight for the national championship. So figured why not get a little bit more Bowman Chrome in. Let's uh, see what we get. See if we can pull up that Caitlin Clark. I'd love to get me a Caitlin Clark. All right, let's get into this. And then maybe some other players too. I don't know. I mean, let's, we'll, we'll see what we, what we end up getting, but uh, Obviously, we're looking for those uh, four uh, uh, pink refractors. Um, we'll see. We'll see if we get any one of them. I would love to get a Clark in one of those, but I, I think that's uh, wishful thinking. So I don't know. We'll see. All right. Hoping for something good, but let's go ahead and get started and uh, get this one knocked out. All right. All right. So let's get started. So we're going to start it off with a Jamal Shade. Shade? 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 I don't know. It's hard to say. All right, on his first Bowman, we got a Haley Van Lith. I don't think we got a Haley last time, so I'm going to put that one aside. That's a nice one. Actually, you know what? Let's go ahead and sleeve that Haley. She's already in the transfer portal going somewhere else. I think she needs to go somewhere where she can be a, a lead scorer. So, L. Ellis, I think we already have that one before. We got Mookie Cook, who's another decent one. I know he's a, a decent prospect out of Oregon over there, so I'll go ahead and sleeve that one too. Um, we'll put the Van Lith off to the side for now. I'm going to put him off to the side. Then our first pink is going to be DJ Wagner for Kentucky. Not a bad pull. I don't remember. I think I just got a DJ Wagner base last time. So let's put that one off to the side. That's not bad at all. Let's get to the next pack. So we've got uh, four cards per. Was it four cards per pack? Oh, we've got five cards in that one. So and we've got uh, seven packs to run through. So let's see what we get on the next one. I think this is just going to be an all base pack. Yep, Prince Aligbe out of uh, Boston College. We've got uh, Georgia Amor, who I think I already got hers in the last the last time I opened this. We got a Scotty Milton out of OSU, and we'll finish that one off with a Javante Taylor out of Memphis. All right, all right. So we got a uh, Kevin McCuller Jr. for out of uh, Kansas. Start that one off. We get ourselves our first. Our first insert, which is, um, I believe someone finally gave me an answer. Um, oh, geez, I'm, I'm blanking on it again. Prodigal, prodigal prospects or something. Or prodigal playmakers, that's what it was. Yeah, so we got a uh, Justin Edwards out of Kentucky in one of those. Prodigal playmakers, that was the name of this insert. So that one's pretty nice, I like that. Put that one off to the side. All right, we get a, a Tyler Burton. And let's see. Uh, Coleman Hawkins, and if you saw me open the pack, you probably saw who we got in our pink. Our next pink is going to be an Angel Reese. All right, so that's a nice pull. I think we did pretty good on that one. Uh, like her or don't like her, uh, she's a pretty solid player. She's a good defensive player. Great defensive player. Great rebounder. She's looking. She's going to be pretty decent. She's going to be probably going to be looking like, like a top 10 pick, maybe like 6th or 7th, maybe. Uh, maybe 8th, I don't know. But she's going to be in the top 10 in the WNBA draft or so coming up, so... Uh, that's a nice one to get. I'm gonna put that one right up front because that that's a good one. I, and I don't mind Aiden Reese. She's a decent player. She's definitely great down low on defense. So, all right, let's move on to the next one. We got uh, Andre Storakovich, and I believe we got him. Maybe got him last time. I know I got him in something else. I was looking at, and looks like we got something good out of this too. So we got Trevon Brazil, uh, Simon. Is it Simon or Simeon or? whatever Wilcher and then uh, Andre Stojakovic out of Stanford that's a good one I like that one actually let's leave that one because I don't recall if we got this card already but I you know I, I was a Peja fan so I'm gonna keep his son's card there and then looks like we got uh, that Sims I don't know how to say his name out of St. John Simeon Wilcher or Wilcher it looks like we got one of him and that's gonna be numbered 48 out of 125 nice and that's going to be the, uh, I think that's the pink uh, wave. Pink wave, I think they call them. Yeah. Uh, uh, so we got a pink wave uh, to 125. So yeah, that's that's awesome. I'll take that and let's go ahead and sleeve them up. 
So now we're pulling for this kid to do, I think St. John's, I don't remember if they made the, I don't believe they made the tournament, but yeah, cool prospect there. Let's put him off to the side. Let's see if we'll, we'll put him right there for now. He's looking like one of our best, him and the Angel Reese are looking like our two best pulls. So uh, let's move on to the next one, see what we get. We got, uh, well, if that one counts as one of our pinks, then we've got probably one pink to pull and we got three packs still, so. Oh, we got a Rikia Jackson. I was hoping to get one of hers because we have not pulled a Rikia. So, but yeah, Rikia Jackson. She's another one that's going to be a top ten pick, possibly third overall, or I think that she's projecting, or maybe even second. But uh, yeah, that's a good one out of Tennessee. Um, I'm definitely going to put her up. I'm actually going to put her over Haley Van Ness. That's a good one. All right, all right. And we got Zayden High out of North Carolina, NC, and then we've got a uh, DJ Wagner on the insert. Um, I believe these are the. Uh, the 2007 Bowman uh, like throwback uh, cards. These are these are nice. I like those. I would love to get one of these in like a Caitlin Clark or something. That would be awesome. But uh, yeah, another DJ Wagner. So we got ourselves some DJ Wagners today. So I'll take that. We'll actually put let's put that one up with the other one of his. Cool. All right. And then Rajan Ellis out of uh, USC. And then we'll finish off with our next pink and might be our last pink. I don't know. Malik Hall out of uh, Michigan State. So we got three. We got three of the, the regular pink refractors, and we've got a nice pink wave. I don't know if we'll get another one. We'll see. Let's find out. So this one's going to be a base. So we've got uh, Zade or yeah, I guess Zade Lowry out of Marquette. That's a nice one. All right, Riley Kugel, and we pulled something else. All right, Aaron Bradshaw out of Kentucky. Um, Riley Kugel, I think I already pulled his card in the last one. And it looks like we've got, oh, ho, 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 Jordan Dingle out of St. John's. We pull our two cards are both St. John's players. So we got Wilcher, and we get an auto of Jordan Dingle out of St. John's. Now, I'm not crazy familiar with uh, St. John's ball, but... I will take an auto all day long, actually. We definitely got a really lucky uh, box here. Um, so that one's numbered eight out of 50. We got an eight out of 50 Jordan Dingle auto, man. That's awesome. And so I believe that's a gold. I don't think that's yellow. I think those are gold. I think out of 50 is gold. So we got an eight out of 50. I mean, we got, this is a monster box. So this was the last box on the shelf. I think I went to Best Buy and got this. Last one on the shelf, we pull an auto to fit gold to 50. So. That one's just taking over the top spot. Let's move Angel over. Sorry, Angel, she's getting moved over. She's still going to be a great one of our great pulls out of this. But how about our luck on this? Getting a pink wave to 125 and a gold auto to 50, man. I mean, I don't think I can ask much for much more. If I pull a pink out of this one, that's just a little icing on the cake, man. We just we 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 just scored out, and I think we did get a pink. All right. So we got a Dusty Stromer. I would have loved to get the uh, Caitlin Clark, but uh, I, I think we'll take what we can get here. I'm going to try to get some more of this stuff. Uh, Dusty Stromer, we get our, our Silver Refractor. That's going to be Ashton Hardaway, um, who I believe is Penny's son. Um, I did correct me if I'm wrong there, but I believe so. Yeah, we got Ashton Hardaway is going to be our Silver. So that's, a good, that's another good pull. Um, we got Caleb Love, who I think we already got that card, and we actually got a pink of him too, I think, or didn't we? I, I want to say I got a wave in the last box we got to 125, and it was a Caleb Love, but I'm not positive. I could be wrong there. Um, all right, we got uh, Garway Dual or Dual or Dual, I don't know. And then our last pink is going to be a Zade Lowry out of Marquette. All right, that's a nice one. I like that too. Zade Lowry, I know, is going to be a, a decent prospect, so that's another one, another good one to get. So icing on the cake, man. We got ourselves a Zade. Cool. All right. So we've got a whole, we got a whole plethora of stuff here, man. We got more pinks that we got all the four, all four pinks that we were wanting, or that we were hoping for that that's supposed to get on the box, and we've got a ton of bonuses. So we got some good DJ Wagner stuff. Some we got our Kentucky guys covered. We got some of the ladies that I wanted. Um, some good stuff. Zade Lowry, and then obviously our two hits are going to be the the pink wave to 125 which ends up being a really cool pull and the gold auto to to 50 man that that is that's outstanding jordan dingle uh i'll take it i'll take it all day long that is a great great pull um so anyway yeah thank you for watching um this this ended up being a hot one let me know what you guys thought 
I really love this. I think this was definitely well worth it. I think Donnie Dub would be proud, man. I think he'd have some he'd have some words for us on this one. You can take that to the bank.